price of kitchen commodities like oil, gas, cylinder had risen rapidly due to economic blockage for more than a month affect everyone. But the major effect are students who stay in your tenant and they came all the way from another district. Here is the story of their fight against price rise. The students which have been studying in Manipur are not the ones which are rich. Most of the rich students have gone outside. We are facing a lot of problems regarding the maximization of the price levels of all the commodities which we use in one day household. And I'm really facing a problem, I should say. Uh, because the, the price of a tomato and all that, that cost 30 to 40 rupees before, now it costs 100. It's hard to find even rice nowadays. They don't want to give us it, you know? Like, uh, since we cannot burn abundantly, we are just buying like per day, per week and all. Uh, due to a money problem, I can't even go from my home to college by vehicle anymore. Uh, I, I come from Lango to Bazaar by Jeep and then from the Jeep parking, I go by foot. It's not an easy thing for us uh, working every day by foot. We are not fighting against the government. What we are doing is we are controlling the price rate of the materials which are being sold in the market. It's nothing related to the government, it's related to we citizens of Manipur. So how many students were being captured? Uh, we, don't, we didn't get the time to count the exact students, but I think it's almost 60 to 70. There were also girls also. We just won the students which have been arrested previously. We won them seven secure. Despite the government regulation and assurance, prices are rising increasingly daily. The student has no option but to take to the street to demand the imposition of government regulation on price rise. Through this video, I hope the people as well as the government will lend a hand to help the students who are in need right now. This is Kami Mercy from Manipur reporting for India Unheard.